This video is going to be extra content for the Haunted and Possessed Dolls episode of the Staring into the Abyss radio show. And this video is going to be on Poopa the doll. Now, besides having a funny name, Poopa is actually a fairly active, fairly spooky doll. Poopa was made back in the 1920s, and it was uh, actually designed to resemble uh, its female Italian owner. It was dressed to look like her, and they even made the doll's hair out of pieces of the owner's real hair. Poopa's owner often claimed that the doll would speak to her, and she insisted until the day that she died that Poopa was not just a doll, that it was in fact a living entity. Um, her family kind of backed her up on this because they said that Poopa looked alive in all of the pictures that they took of the doll. And sometimes it was even hard to distinguish Poopa from her owner in those pictures. Um, the owner died in early 2005, and when the owner died, the family put Poopa in a glass case. Um, the doll does not like being locked away in a case. Um, she will change positions inside the case, and there's even been a few times where she has managed to escape the case and get away. Um, she'll move items around uh, in her display case when she feels restless, because there's it's not just her in the case or stuff in there with her. And um, the doll's facial expression will often change uh, when someone looks at the doll for a long period of time. Now, I don't know for a fact if this is the doll actually changing its facial expressions, or if this is just one of those cases of if you stare at something long enough, what you're waiting to see, you're going to see. You know what I mean? You see that sometimes when, if you stare at an object for too long, it tends to move, or if in the dark when you wake up, if you look at a shadow too long, it can look like any kind of monster you imagine. That might be what's going on with the facial expressions, or maybe they're changing. I'm not exactly sure. But um, one thing that isn't just staring at the doll is when the doll gets tired of being in the case and it gets too restless, it'll start actually knocking and banging on the glass of the display case, and it's audible for people to hear. So I guess that's really not a trick of just, you know, looking too long. That's something that you can hear. So that's been Poopa, the haunted doll.